how to add a favicon in hostinger website builder hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial in today's video i'm going to show you how simple and easy it is to have a favicon into your hostinger website so the favicon is usually going to be the specific icon or the specific logo that will appear on the um, specific tab of the browser so as you can see we have this h or um, going to be the abbreviation of Hostinger, as you can see, logo or favicon appearing in this tab. So how we can make this our uh, specific logo, or we can make that for the specific website that we have created on Hostinger. The process is going to be very easy. You're going to head over the H panel or the dashboard of Hostinger, click on websites, select the websites list, and from here, you're going to select the websites that contain the specific uh, logo of the Hostinger website builder. Now, what are we going to do basically is to select one of the websites and click on edit website. Now, once you have the uh, specific editor opened or the Hostinger website builder opened, you're going to head over the parameter of your website. How you can do that? Basically, you are going to head over the left side of the screen, as you can see in here, click on the three dots that are going to uh, be meaning more settings. From here, you are going to head over the general settings and you're going to see that we have the first thing that will appear, Favicon. We're going to click on it and then you're going to see the live preview. For the moment, we do not have a a specific favicon so we can add here an image you can add a logo a selected image or whatever you can use canva to create these type of favicons or you can use also a photoshop you're going to see here the preview of this specific website favicon appearing in here i usually do not support these random photos or these random pictures but I highly suggest for you to create one from Canva. Then we are going to click on change or save changes. Then you are going to have it right away. And when a person or you are going to visit your website, you're going to see the favicon of the choice that you have put. Basically, that was uh, pretty much it. Do not forget to click on update or uh, the website. So the parameters or the settings are going to be set up correctly and here we have it basically that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and i hope to see you soon on the next one